My name is Jonathan Bridges and I'm responsible for Cloud at Exponentially. Exponentially is, a, is an organization that's grown up over the last 10 years. We've come from being, a, if you like, a traditional telco, but then focusing on niche markets um, and supporting customers in their growth in that space. And now we've moved into the cloud arena and now focused on creating the integrated solution for cloud and networks for customers to simplify their journey to the clouds. From a services perspective, we have a, a variety of services from network capabilities, providing interconnectivity for our clients, voice services and unified comms. Uh, and then in addition to that, we have a wealth of cloud services covering you know, infrastructure as a service, uh, desktop as a service, and now some of our latest releases, uh, GPU-based desktop as a service, which really is our, you know, one of our latest uh, services that we've released, which is focused on providing high-end graphical performance uh, in that ecosystem of providers. GPU is important to a lot of customers because the applications that the users need require more power to actually deliver a good user experience. So if you're looking at things like any CAD packages or even up to rendering of graphics, then a normal desktop or a VDI session or, or something that's delivered normally doesn't have the power required. So to give the right user experience, you need the extra graphics power for the user. Advantages of GPU in the cloud are around users that have peaks and troughs. So if you have somebody that has a production company looking at film or somebody doing uh, automotive design or anything around high-end sort of packages, then if they get contractors in or they have staff coming in for periods of, of time, what they can actually do is consume desktops as and when they need them. So they can have add 10, add 100, add 1,000 for a month, for two months, and then reduce back down to their baseline. So if, if it, it, it's a way of them saving from having to go out and spend capital expenditure rather than building a contract, which means they can look at operating expenditure and just deliver as and when they need users rather than having to have a load of machines standing around for periods of time not doing anything. Exponentially's GPU offering is unique purely because of the level of service from network through to end user, we can actually deliver globally. Um, the GPU is, is, is actually giving users the model which instead of having to refresh large expensive machines every three, five years, they can actually deliver today an experience that is constantly evolving. So they may get something today which in six months in a year looks completely different. But from an end user point of view, they're just getting what is required so they can do their job at any location, offering flexibility, but also looking at the company's requirements around intellectual property sort of restrictions. And you know, from the network up, I think, I think we can deliver a very, very good required user experience. And users are demanding this today. We're seeing lots of shifts in the market at the moment in relation to the adoption of clouds. Three or four years ago, the cloud was in its infancy and the adoption was quite slow. But now, infrastructure as a service has become mainstream and our customers are expecting to be able to take those services coupled with our network. In addition to that, with the advancement of technology, we're also seeing a major shift in people wanting higher and richer services in the cloud. Our GPU services are addressing that and some of our future services around platforms and big data are going to be the next set of iterations that we bring to the table to support our customers' migration to the cloud and journey to a more cloud-native landscape. We differentiate our products and services by the coupling of our network and our cloud services together. And we provide all of those services under one SLA where we are the true provider of all of those capabilities end to end. So from a customer base, we've developed a great customer base over the last 12 years. We have around 1,700 customers focused in all kinds of sectors from finance, not-for-profit, media. Today, one of our big focuses is looking at those customers in the media sector. We brought our GPU-based capabilities to the table, but that has also has extensibility from a product set out into engineering, manufacturing, anyone who is looking for those high-performance services will want to take the benefits of the cloud to deliver that in an agile and OPEX-based manner.